But that's not the only way in which jelly is evolving. There are a couple of new boys on the block who are completely changing the way in which we think about how this dish should look. Bompus and Pa use state-of-the-art computer-aided design to create their startling-looking jellies. How he worked out that using the sorts of things he'd been taught as, you know, as part of his architectural training, we could design and make our own jelly moulds. I started off with the hardest mould, which was uh, to recreate St Paul's Cathedral. Um, and I, I managed just about to do it. So from then on in, it was plain sailing. And this is where we really started um, you know, doing jellies for a living from. So I challenged the guys to make me a fancy jelly. It's time for the grand unveiling. OK. That's it. So I've kind of positioned it where I want it on the plate, but just wetting it and shaking it. And there we go. And that is... It's Buckingham Palace and beautiful orange and camelings jelly. Jelly may not look the same or frankly taste the same as it did when I was a child, but either way, I'm delighted to see it making such a spirited comeback.